praise the Lord, precious saints. Well, this very evening, I felt uh, led by the Holy Spirit to to teach and also pray against uh, New Age, in particular, the third eye awakening and the dangers uh, that are also uh, implications to those that go and think they can just go and open the third eye so you need to understand the third eye awakening dangers is a cult and brings in your life tormenting spirits so the common way to open your third eye is through altered state of meditation where you empty your mind uh, by doing mantras etc now to be honest with you most of the people that I speak to uh, especially in the area of deliverance and they suffer you know they really do get tormented once they open up these third eyes and you know they'll feel the manifestation of these spirits uh, the kundalinis and so forth the serpent spirits coming into their bodies being tormented not being able to get deliverance because you know they've opened up themselves to things that they really do not understand so we're going to first learn a little bit about it and also the biological uh, connection so the third eye or the pineal gland that is a small uh, endocrine gland in the vertebrate brain now this gland produces serotonin uh, and also um, it is a hormone so it works in harmony um, within the other glands around. So we must understand that this is biological, but also we're going to look at the third eye energy center. So the third eye is the most powerful energy centers located in the center of the forehead. The awakening raises one's frequency and moves into spiritual worlds. So the pineal gland is the gateway that leads to inner realms of space or higher consciousness, including seeing energy or seeing beings or spirit guides or demonic spirits. So we can also see that with this particular area, it also enables us to have spiritual experiences so there is a a negative and there is a positive but there is also a legal entry so there's legal entries through the holy spirit and there's illegal entry through demonic forces so the third eye is the satanic portal to the demonic realm so what is happening when having a third eye awakening you open yourself up to the second heaven so home of the demonic world so the demons now have the right to use your body as a conduit into the occult world so we see that also with astro travel and so forth so opening the third eye achieves the following so the occult world wants to be able to see beyond the physical world into the spiritual world they believe that you will have clarity intuition dis decisiveness and insight they believe that they will have clear channels and abilities to feel energy more effectively they want to have visions to receive wisdom they want to have a personal uh, being to help them learn about themselves so let us look also at some of the um, things that come about so a common occurrence when opening the third eye awakening is the manifestation of the psychic gifts called clairvoyancy or second sight so these are not gifts from god but are the gifts from the demonic realm so in the hindu religion they practice yoga as a form of meditation to open up their six chakra so when from the demonic realm you are opening yourselves up to death spiritually so that is why the bible strictly says that we're not to partake of any of those occultish things and that's why god forbade it forbid it for the israelites and also is forbidding it for us do not touch that unclean thing but come out from among them so how they open the third eye besides altered state meditations they use oil essential oils to help stimulate the pineal glands 
and facilitate states of spiritual awareness. So essential oils through inhaling directly, burning uh, diffusers or incense sticks or nebulizers or adding you know things to to bath waters and so forth doing omus during chanting causings causes the bone in the nose to resonate or stimulate the pineal gland so they use crystals magnets oils to help open the third eye rubbing uh, your index finger counterclockwise on your forehead and even tapping your forehead that's what they do so in buddhism the middle eye is known as the uh, Shavanalam Hinduism. So the third eye is known as the clairvoyancy, uh, clairvoyancum for Egypt. The third eye is known as the eye of Horus or the eye within Freemasonry. So it is the all seeing eye. So the eye usually means the, the, the same es, uh, esoteric knowledge that man so desires. So the Hebrew word for eyes is not plural, but singular. So that the serpent said was that their eye would be broadened by knowledge. Scripture here is not talking about the physical origin, but the eye of the soul. So ungodly soul ties are often linked through the invisible spiritual umbilical cord that attaches to the navel so the symptoms after the third eye awakening is that energy pulls shifts sensations of heaviness heat and cold if you find yourself frequent frequently out of control of various body parts bodily functions and other manifestations of like serpent spirits or things moving around your body and not having any control, you are experiencing the outward signs that suggest that you need to be delivered inside your spiritual body. So we must look at that today and then understand what it is that is causing these things to take place. So the following, we're going to say some prayers and we're going to rebuke these things, but the following refers to body energy centers known as chakras so this we, we're obviously when we open up the third eye and there are also other areas of chakras without the body so it doesn't matter if you believe they exist or not god created them just like he created your arm or your leg but the enemy attacks them and since most don't believe they exist the attack goes unchallenged and the damage will accumulate so always divide uh, you know these things separated soul from spirit and never go looking for things or exploring outside of God's protection just understand they exist and protect them from the enemy and learn the difference between the physical the metaphorical and the spiritual so we're going to just start this prayer right now so heavenly father in the name of jesus christ we command all astral projection ungodly silver cords implants ley liners and spirit triggers to be removed in the name of jesus christ we cancel all satan's assignments against our family both human and spiritual in jesus mighty name we we close all gateways and portals including the third eye the enemy may use in the name of Jesus we be closed now in Jesus name we seal and cover ourselves and the whole family with the precious blood of Jesus Christ right now we declare that we are hidden in the secret place of the Most High according to Psalm 91 in Jesus mighty name we declare we are invincible to the enemy enemy and we are invisible to his things and hidden in Christ today in heavenly places in Jesus mighty name we thank you Lord Lord for all of our enemies are now removed from your presence right now in the name of Jesus Christ we release the blinding light of God on all evil spiritual hosts that ever try to come near us or our family in Jesus mighty name 
we declare that we are clothed in the glorious armor of light right now lord that every sickness depression distraction discouragement oppression go now in the mighty name of our lord jesus christ we bind the prince of the power of the air and all his networks and destroy all of their strategies and their assignments against ourselves and family right now in the name of our lord jesus christ we release the anointing of God over ourselves, over our family, and over all of our circumstances. Angels of God, they must also come under the obedience of Christ right now and attack right now on our behalf. All demons must go back to the pit of hell, never to return in Jesus' mighty name. And we cut all ties to anything that we've done. And through the precious blood of Jesus Christ, the Bible says in 1 John 1, 9, if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. So anything that you've done, anything that you've participated on throughout this period of time that you are, maybe you're not aware. Maybe you have forgotten about those things. It's just time to confess them right now. Lord, we confess all those things right now that they're mentioning right now in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ and the blood of Jesus is faithful to cover us and cleanse us from all unrighteousness so Heavenly Father we thank you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ we break dissolve sever crush and destroy every ungodly soul tie hook link and a connection attached to our base chakra in Jesus mighty name in Jesus name we bind everything that came into us from those connections in Jesus name and we close every door that was open to those things and we take away every legal bind or bond and every legal hold that they have on us and we cut and loosen from all their assignments in Jesus name in the name of our Lord Jesus we order everything that came into us to leave now in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ father in Jesus name we ask you to send angels to bind up these things and return them to whoever sent them to bring them to repentance in the name of Jesus Christ right now whoever that person was Lord we pray this right now in Jesus writing name. in the the name of our Lord Jesus Christ right now we break dissolve sever crash and destroy every ungodly soul tie hook link and connection attached to anything to do with our sexual um, chakra in Jesus mighty name in Jesus name we bind everything that came into us from those connections in Jesus name we close every door that was open to those things we take away every every legal bond and every legal hold that they have on us and we cut them loose from their assignments now in Jesus mighty name Lord we thank you father Lord that in order that everything that came into us must leave now in Jesus name father in Jesus name we ask you to send angels to bind up these things and return them to whoever ever sent them to bring those people also whoever sent to repent Repentance in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we break dissolve, sever, crush and destroy every ungodly soul tie, hook, link and connection attached to our plein, our spleen chakra in Jesus mighty name. In Jesus name we bind everything that came into us from those connections in Jesus name and we close every door, Lord, that was open to those things and we apply the blood of Jesus and we take away every legal bond and every legal hope that has had a upon our lives and we cut them loose from from us and from their assignment against us in Jesus name in the name of our Lord Jesus we order everything that came into us to leave now in the name of Jesus father in Jesus name we ask you to send angels to bind up those things and return them to whoever sent them right now in the name of Jesus Christ Lord then you would bring those people back to repentance in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ we break 
break, dissolve, sever, crush, and destroy every ungodly soul tie, hook, link, and connection attached to our heart chakra in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' name, we bind everything that came into us from those connections in Jesus' name. We close every door that was open to those things. And Lord, we take away every legal bond and every legal hold they have on us and we cut them loose from us all and from their assignments in Jesus mighty name in the name of our Lord Jesus we order everything that came into us to leave now father in Jesus mighty name we ask you to send angels to bind up these things and return them to whoever sent them to bring them to repentance also in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ we break dissolve sever crush and destroy every ungodly soul tie hook link and connection attached to our throat chakra in Jesus mighty name Lord we pray and we bind everything that came into us from those connections in every Lord every part in Jesus name we close every door that was open to those things and we take away every legal bond and every legal hold that has and had a way and we cut loose those things and their assignments in Jesus name in the name of Jesus we order everything that came into us to leave now in the name of Jesus and Father in Jesus name we ask you to send angels to bind up those things and return them to whoever sent them to us and bring them to repentance in the name of Jesus we pray Lord we pray in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ we break dissolve sever crush and destroy every ungodly soul tie hook link and connection attached to our third eye chakra in Jesus name Lord we pray Lord in the name of Jesus we bind everything that came into us from this connection in the name of our Lord Jesus and we close every door that was open to those things and take away every legal bomb and every legal hold that have had on us and we cut those things from all their assignments in Jesus mighty name in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ we order everything that came into us to leave now in the name of Jesus Father in Jesus name we ask you to send angels to bind up these things and return them to whoever sent them to bring them to repentance in Jesus mighty name we pray and believe in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ we break dissolve sever crush and destroy every ungodly soul tie hook link and connection attached to our crown chakra in Jesus name in Jesus name we bind everything that came into us from those connections in Jesus name and we close every door that was open to those things and we take away every legal bond and every legal hold that had and we cut loose those things from their assignment in Jesus name in the name of Jesus in order that everything that came into us must leave now in the name of Jesus we pray father we thank you Lord and we ask Lord through your son that you will send your angels to bind up those things to return them to whoever sent them to bring them to repentance in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ we bind all blocks attached to any of our chakras anything to the base to the head to the crown to the eyes to the sexual every chakra to be bound in Jesus name where we bind the strong man over those blocks attached to our base chakra to all chakras now and we toss him off his throne right now in the name of Jesus Christ whatever has been trying to block those ways and stop us from coming into the full freedom in Jesus name father we ask you to send the angels to bind the strong man inside these boxes inside of all the boxes no matter how deep with angels reading scripture to them right now in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ that they may leave in the name of Jesus Christ we bind all demons controlling these blocks and we command them to leave now in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ father 
Father, please send your angels to bind these demons and send them where you want them to go. Back to the pit of hell right now in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name, we break, deactivate, cut, sever, destroy every interconnect support device between these blocks in the name of any of these blocking spirits. In Jesus' name, we break, deactivate, sever, cut, destroy every hook device that allows attachment to our chakra in Jesus' name. Lord, we thank you. We bind all blocks to our uh, authority in the third heaven, and we command you to leave now in Jesus' mighty name. Father, please send angels to bind these blocks and send them right now back to the pit of hell, right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, in heaven, we pray, Lord, that you will send your angels to repair all damage done to us by these blocks and change us, Lord, so that we won't be able to be hooked into this thing again in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Break it, Lord, from the sex chakras. Break it, Lord, from the spleen chakras, Lord. Lord, break it, Lord Jesus. Lord, from every aspect of our life right now, from the heart chakras, break it right now in the name of our Lord Jesus. From the throat chakra, break it right now in the name of our Lord Jesus. From the eye chakra, break Break it right now in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Just break it, Lord. 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 In the name of Jesus, Satan, you have no hold over us. And we break all your holds upon us today in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. And we know that Satan has a plan for everyone's life, but just as God has a plan for everyone's life, that plan has someone in charge of it and a lot of subordinate spirits directing it. And it is a very good idea to get rid of Satan's plan and substitute it right now for God's plan. And according to God's word, it says that the handwritten agreement that was written against us has never now be nailed to the cross of Jesus Christ and he disarmed and he brought to an open shame every principality every demonic force every strong man what through the victory of the cross of our Lord Jesus Christ so Lord we thank you right now in the name of our Lord Jesus in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ we bind the strong man over Satan's plan for our life and we toss him off his throne right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we ask you to send angels to bind the strong man inside of boxes, inside of more boxes, no matter how levels they are, how deep it is, how many hindering spirits are with angels singing, singing scripture to them day and night, tormenting them right now and sending your angels to bring them up with a flame of sword right now, a sword of flame in the name of Jesus. Father, we ask you to send angels to guard Lord, everything that you're doing in our lives in the name of our Lord Jesus, we bind all demons subordinate to the strong man over Satan's plan for our life. In Jesus' name, we cut you loose from all your assignments. We cut every door that has been opened to you. We cancel every legal hold and every legal ground that you have had over us in the name of Jesus Christ. We command all demons subordinate to the strong man over Satan's plan for our life to leave now in Jesus mighty name go back to the pit of hell right now and Lord we thank you in Jesus name we bind all spirits and entities under the command of the strong man over Satan's plan for life in Jesus name we cut you loose from your assignments also and go back to the pit of hell in the name of Jesus Christ we cancel every legal hold every legal ground that you've had over us in the name of Jesus Christ and we loosen all those things everything that goes down Every, we loose you from all your commands, controls, attachments, mind control, programming, agreements, oaths, and bonds to the strong man over Satan's plan for our lives and any of all the subordinates. We command all demons to go right now back to the pit of hell and we command all entities to go back right now and be removed in the name of Jesus Christ, never to return 
in Jesus' mighty name. Heavenly Father, I thank you for the Holy Spirit that is here that will continue to minister unto those people, bringing complete deliverance to every manifestation that is coming to them right now as you're closing and shutting and you're bringing them closer to your presence Lord, that they may know you. For this is the Bible, John 17, 3. This is eternal life, that they may know you, God, and your son, the Christ, that they may go and grow into intimacy with you. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. This is Pastor Robert Clancy from Narrow Path Ministries in Perth, Western Australia. It is now time to catch the fire of repentance revival as we prepare for the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. Shalom.